Um, another fantastic new member of the Loxley uh, Darts Massive, so to speak, is the young Zach Thornton, uh, who helped design your most recent darts, uh, which apparently combine two of your previous darts in a sort of hybrid design. Yeah, I like Zach. He's a nice guy. Um, met him a few times. He, he's bought a few shirts for me to sign up to uh, Coventry. Um, and yeah, I mean, I sent him couple of designs of my old set of darts and he sort of just made a, a set which was a hybrid of the two and uh, yeah I really like them they're going well yeah I speak to Zach a lot uh, a lot outside of uh, outside of darts and stuff as well since uh, since getting to know him he's a really nice guy and uh, I said so how was it designing uh, you know for Ryan starts he said Ryan was so easy like Ryan's like I've got sort of two darts I quite like them. you know have a, have a look and <laughs> see what you think and uh, I'm very laid back. You know, so. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I mean, he's he's done a fantastic job, and uh, you know, how are you getting on with those new darts? Do you think the the new, well, I guess the new showings sort of speak for themselves? Really, are you are you fully comfortable with them now? Yeah, I feel good with them. I mean, when I first got them, the grip wasn't as harsh as what my darts before were. Um, that took a little bit of getting used to, but I mean, my old darts were probably a bit too grippy from the start, so it took a bit of wearing in for me to, to feel comfortable. So with these, I probably feel comfortable you know, straight out of the case when they're new, you know, so you know, that's, that's a good thing. Yeah. I mean, what what features are most important that you put forward to, to Zach for the dart? Because, I mean, obviously... 32 grams is what people are going to be shouting at me going like, mm -hmm. you know, you, you have the heaviest darts and you must be tired of talking about it. But I mean, how, how, what are the most yeah, important features, first of all? Yeah, as long as they're 32 grams, yeah, I don't mind what they're like. Yeah. Um, the, I like more of the, um, I don't like straight power, I like more of the, the rounded. Sort of torpedo or bomb sort of yeah, style. Yeah, like a bomb sort of shape rather than the, straight barrels mm. so I, thought, I used to throw a straight barrel and I used to find that I didn't I'd forget how I gripped the dart like, mm. it was weird but with the, the more of the bomb sort of barrel I you know more consistent than I grip it yeah you can find that balance how, how did you get to 32 grams um well it's funny really I started with a 22 23 gram Andy Fordham dart when I very first started, uh, I bought from JJB Sports <laughs> back in the day. And uh, when was that? Do you remember? Oh, God. I've been playing for... Uh, I've been playing for 12 years, so it was about 12, 13 years ago. Um, and I used to throw them. They're quite cheap now. I used to throw them with short nylon stems and pair flights. Yeah. How the hell I used to throw them, I do not know. <laughs> <laughs> My dad really likes to be throwing them. Uh, <laughs> I think it was more of a gimmick, really. I was like, oh, I want to throw my like, really short darts. But, yeah. And then I went from that to 31 gram heavy darts. So that was more of a gimmick then. I was like, I'm going to throw really heavy darts because no one else throws heavy darts. And where'd you get those 31 gram darts from? Um, I think I got them on eBay. Yeah. Did you specifically go, do you know what? Yeah. I'm going to try and impress yeah. the ladies. I'm going to go I for it. I like the shape of the I was I was playing really well with them. And then I used, I went for a spell where I was just buying all sorts of different sets of darts, just messing around with like a set of Gary Anderson's, Terry Jenkins ones, um, all different ones. And then I found a set in my local pub which some people left behind. And I hit 140 from the first three darts. I thought, oh, I'll use them. I think they're about 24 grams, really old, like looked really like haggard old things. 
and I used them for about four years, I think, something like that. And uh, I got bored of them, started throwing those heavy darts again, hitting absolutely everything. And then, you know, I, I stuck with the heavy darts from there. I got a good friend called um, Trevor Perry, he's the Devon, he's, he was a Devon captain for years. He's played, he's made 215 appearances for Devon County. Um, I told him I'd change back to 31 rounds, and he was like, why are you doing that? No way. And then I was playing for Devon A at the time, and my first game with him, I had like a 32 average or a 31 average. And he was like, oh, well, what do I know then? You know, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I stuck with him from there. So. I think, I think it's, it's great. I mean, you... you... I, I'm due to try some very soon, and I'm I'm just curious to see how diff, how much difference there is because I throw 23 gram, which is, I guess is fairly mm. standard. I have got used to quite light darts. I tried to, uh, I, at the moment I'm throwing a 20 gram um, Kita Ono solo dart. Um, so yeah, 20 23 though is where I like it. But I mean, have you ever tried the 12 gram Stephen Buntings by any chance? No, I haven't. I wouldn't mind giving them a go. I, I would love throw, to get you. Things, yeah, I'd love to get you two together. Obviously, the the lightest and heaviest, and switch darts and see uh, see. How... I think that is definitely a thing for the dart show. Is for me and him to play a leg against each other with each other's darts. That's yeah, hundred percent. If that happens, I'm watching. I, I'll record it and everything. I think that'd be really good. But to be fair, a lot of people on the tour, all the pros have tried my darts, pretty much all of them, and a lot of them like it. Yeah. Peter Wright, first row, 180, like it would. And uh, who else is there? <laughs> I can imagine Red Dragon going, oh, no, he's going to want to know. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I can't remember, it was just before, like the Premier League. Because it was last year, not this year. And I said, oh, you can buy them off me if you like, because I know you're like, <laughs> switching darts, so you just hit a 180. And um, Devin Peterson, he quite likes them. Uh, Chizzy hated them. His flicky... Like a little flick at the end of his throat, he does. They go all over the place. Um, yeah, most people like them. I think Andrew Lewis liked them at the end for him. But um, they're hugely popular on the second-hand market um, on Facebook and no, 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 stuff. No, no. Oh, it's, um, it's, and, and, and they were so excited when obviously Loxy were bringing out. They're like, oh yeah, you know, we're definitely going to get these, and I'm going to buy, buy a set and put them aside. You know, I speak a lot to. Uh, all the all the sort of big sellers and um, people to get sort of ideas and things off people, but the uh, the older Ryan sells, you can't get hold of them anymore. It's so hard to get hold of. Well, I had things back in the day. I had so many different sets made. Um, I can't I don't can't remember how many sets I've made to be honest. But it's quite a few. Um, when my girlfriend's mum works at my school, my um, little boy goes to. And the bloke that delivers the meat, because she's the head cook at the school, um, he delivers the meat to her and he's in, massively into darts and he's like a huge supporter of me and I didn't realise. And he didn't realise that um, she was my girlfriend's mum. So obviously they got talking about darts and, him, and he's just bought one of my new shirts and he had my, ve he had my very first darts I ever had me. And... Um, he was at the pub playing and he um, went to get a drink at the bar and he turned his back and someone nicked him. And uh, so obviously he didn't have any darts. And I seen him today, I don't know how long ago it was, but I seen him today. I've never met him before in my life. He's been a massive supporter of me. And um, I knew he was going to be at school today and he's always there on Friday. So I took him up one of my um, heavy metal darts I had just before these ones that I made. So I took him up to set for him to have today. You know. Oh, but it was made up. Which is good. Oh, amazing. I bet he was absolutely uh, absolutely over the moon with that.